Hello everyone. There is no doubt that Wi-Fi is running our lives. According to research, it's the number one thing that people cannot live without. But no matter where you are in the world, you have probably experienced internet connectivity issues at some point. To overcome this problem, Wi-Fi Lite Fidelity was introduced in 2011. It was designed to use LED light bulbs for connectivity similar to those which are currently being used in houses and offices. Wi-Fi is a type of bidirectional wireless connection that can be up to 100 times faster than traditional Wi-Fi. Imagine a world where you can connect to a high-speed internet by just turning on your light switch. Let's take a deeper look. Wi-Fi is a wireless optical networking technology that uses LEDs or infrared light for data transmission. It is considered a light-based Wi-Fi technology that uses light instead of radio waves to transmit data. Unlike traditional Wi-Fi which uses radio frequency, Wi-Fi uses light frequency and its band spectrum is 10,000 times more than radio frequency. Wi-Fi technology only needs a light source LED bulb with a chip inside to transmit signals through the light waves. The good thing is Wi-Fi technology will allow you to connect to the internet using light from lamps, street lights and LED televisions. In addition to being cheaper, safer and faster than Wi-Fi, it doesn't need a router. All you have to do is point your devices towards a light bulb. to surf the internet wifi uses direct modulation methods similar to those used in infrared communication devices such as remote control led light bulbs have high intensities therefore can achieve large data rates and transfer much more information wifi data is transmitted by led bulbs and received by photo detector multiple light bulbs make a wireless network and every light has an ip address for easy identification and tracking wifi is a full duplex technology you can send and receive data at the same time let's break it down into further details wifi works based on visible light communication principle for wireless communication at very high speed it requires two main components to drive the internet such as led bulb and wifi dongles It also requires a bulb driver for internet connection. Wi-Fi dongle is used as a photo detector and performs amplification and data processing. All right, so when an electrical current is applied to an LED light bulb, a stream of light, also known as photons, is emitted from the bulb. Within those emitted streams, data travel to the photo detector. Photo detector collects the information and processes received data into electrical signals. Then signals are converted into a binary stream that is recognized by the computers in the form of audio, video or image applications that run on internet enabled devices. Light streams that are emitted from the bulbs are undetectable to the human eye because LED bulbs are semiconductors. which means that a constant current of electricity is supplied to an led bulb and modulation in the light flowing through led bulbs changes at extremely high speeds that's why it cannot be seen by the human eye this makes the communication seamless as other radio systems and allows the users to be connected where there is wifi enabled light what are the benefits of using wifi faster current wifi speed fluctuates between 11 and 300 megabits per seconds while wifi speed can go over 100 gigabits per seconds 14 times faster than wi gig also known as the world's fastest wifi but it has been proven that wifi could reach up to 224 gigabits per seconds this means 1.5 gb movie could be downloaded in milliseconds mind blowing cheaper it is 10 times cheaper than traditional wifi it needs limited components and uses less energy all you have to do is turn on a light accessibility 
any outfitted light can easily be converted into an internet connection point for example street lights can be used to provide li-fi hotspots reliability li-fi transmits signals without interruptions which makes communication more reliable than traditional wi-fi security light doesn't pass through the walls like radio waves this prevents hackers from intercepting li-fi communications more bandwidth light spectrum is 10000 times broader than the radio spectrum which rises the volume of data it can carry and transmit transportation li-fi can be used vehicle to vehicle communication for traffic management couple of drawbacks mobility is an issue because light cannot pass through the walls without a light source li-fi doesn't work here is closing thought airports hospitals and streets are among the other areas where li-fi technology could bring exceptional performance the boom in mobile phones and the rising demand for higher bandwidth are expected to push the development of li-fi technology in the next few years all right so this was all about li-fi thanks for watching please subscribe